33 prisoners were handed over to Ukraine by the authorities of the so-called People's Republics in Donetsk and Luhansk. They were convicted and serving time in prisons before the beginning of Russian aggression. None of them have seen their relatives in five years. Six of them have an open form of tuberculosis, and to avoid infecting others, they cannot remove their masks. Four hundred and fifty such prisoners have applied to be transferred out of the occupied territories. The Russian-controlled governments in occupied territories have only allowed half of those to leave. Seven applied directly through the office of the ombudswoman, others through their parents or themselves. There are those who, after the necessary actions, including after the penitentiary service, makes a decision, will be released. They will go home because they have served their time. Many of them serve their time or their prison term is almost up. There are guys who have served for a year, year and a half. For their families, it is important that they return home because it is easier for them to visit them or send them food packages. 33 prisoners who have expressed a desire to serve their time on the territory of Ukraine are already in these vans. Now they will be taken to the Starobilsky detention facility. Their further fate will be decided in the Ministry of Justice of Ukraine. Reported by Anastasia Volkova, UATV.